everyone, this is me, Morgan Bree and Birch reporting for Kids First, age 12, and right now we're here in Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm super excited. We're going to go and talk to some amazing people here at the 23rd annual The Real Awards. I'm super excited. We're going to talk to some amazing people who impersonate many different people. So I'm really excited. We're going to find out how they do it and why they got started into it. So come on, let's go. So what's one of your favorite parts about being able to portray Marilyn Monroe and be able to show the world more about her because a lot of people know what happened. The best part about being Marilyn is she's probably the most famous and beautiful woman in the world. So if people think I look like her, then that's a good thing, right? You are very beautiful, so you know what? It fits your character perfectly. Thank you. I'm here with Adele, so how are you today, ma'am? I am wonderful, how are you? I'm doing fantastic. So I love your accent, it is simply perfect. Why, thank you very much, I like yours. Thanks. <laughs> well, I love your outfit, so who are you wearing? You know, I never keep up with all these stylists. My, uh, my personal stylist put me in this and um, said I looked beautiful and sent me off, so I'm not very sure. Well, you know what? You do look beautiful, so he was not lying. Why, thank you very much. It's very kind. And also, what's one of your favorite parts? Because I know you are a singer. What's one of your favorite parts about being able to sing? I love to put my emotion into my songs. I write all the words to my songs, and all of them are about relationships and love, and love lost, and love found, and emotions that I can give. So I love sharing um, emotions through song and having others feel those emotions as well. Well, could you please sing a little bit for me, please? I would love to. How about um, some hello? Sure. All right. Hello, it's me. I was wondering if after all these years you'd like to me to go over everything. They say that I'm supposed to heal you, but I ain't done much healing. Is that good for you? Beautiful, amazing. I'm here with Louis Armstrong, so how are you? I'm doing well, and you? I'm doing fantastic. So I know that you're carrying your trumpet. Can yeah. you please play a bit for me? Okay, I'll play a little something for you. That's wonderful. So what's it like being able to be a singer because you are known around the world and you have some so many brilliant songs? Uh, when you're a man of my stature, you usually have to sing to, to, to fight off the women. So I gotta, I gotta make a pass, so I just sing a song and that's it. They, they all line up and I make a pass, just like the tidal wave, you know, and that's it. Gotcha, definitely understandable. So can you please sing just a little bit for me because I've heard a couple of your songs, yeah. but if I got to hear you sing in person, it would just probably like my heart would go like, oh my gosh. All right, here we go, you ready? Yes. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. If you can use some exotic booze, there's a bar in far Bombay. Come on, fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. How about that, baby? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, thank you so much, You're sir. You're welcome, darling. It is a pleasure meeting you. Yeah, it's a pleasure meeting and you. And you All have right. a magnificent right. voice. Mm, you be careful. You, take you care too. All right. I'm here with Martha, Martha Stewart, so how are you? I'm doing great. I'm just so happy to be here. So what's it like being able to uh, cook and be able to, well, show people how to do amazing crafts and be able to have holiday specials and everything? Well, you know, I love it, but people just don't get excited about cooking and crafts as they do some of these wonderful singers that are here. But I love being here with everyone and, and showing, enjoying this great moment. Actually, a friend of mine that's coming up shortly, Trinity from The Matrix, she's actually a children's book author and she's going to be doing some cooking recipes that we're going to be featuring here at the show. So, awesome. Matter of fact, she's right here. Oh, I introduce hello. you. This is Hello. She's, I was telling her about your books with the children's oh, recipes yeah. in them and that she's going to help children how to cook great recipes. Sweet. I would love to get the book. It's a book series, and each book has a set of recipes in the back, and Martha Stewart has been submitting recipes for us. Wow, that's awesome. It's going to be great. I'm so happy you love me. You're one of my little monsters. <laughs> so what's one of your favorite parts about being able to go up and sing to people and be able to have them enjoy your music? 
Uh, I think one of the best parts about it is just being able to feel their love towards me um, and being able to share what I know and what I do best for them. And the fact that they enjoy it is absolutely awesome. I understand that completely. And also, what's one of your uh, favorite songs that you were able to sing? Oh, I think one of my favorite songs is Born This Way. Oh, I love that one too. It's absolutely one of my favorites. And I loved it when you sung it up on the Super Bowl. It was just like, oh my gosh, amazing. Oh, thank you, darling. Thank you. Well, thank you so much for watching this Morgan Birch. I was here at the 23rd annual Amazing um, The Real, and I'm super excited. I hope you guys can be able to watch some more and be able to come to the 24th The Real Awards. And this Morgan Birch signing out. Thank you for watching Kids First. Kids First. Kids First. Bye. See you next time. This Morgan Birch signing out on Kids First, where we tell your kids that they should be watching by real kids, not adults.